Alcohol that's not sold in state stores in Pennsylvania? That's weird. Hey everyone, today is Wednesday, January 30th, and today I wanted to talk about something that's that's coming up in the state I grew up in, the state of Pennsylvania. For pretty much my entire life, PA has kind of had this very weird law that, uh, with the exception of bars and maybe a couple of like pizza joints and stuff, the only place you could buy alcohol was in a state-owned store. Well, this is about to change because uh, the governor, governor of Pennsylvania, Tom Corbett, has announced that he is going to uh, essentially allow uh, private stores to sell alcohol. This is going to involve shutting down uh, pretty much all of the nearly 600 state-owned stores and allowing twice as many privately held businesses to open up and sell alcohol. In addition, uh, alcohol will be allowed to s be sold in other places like grocery stores. Actually, may I want to look up the grocery store one, but overall, this is a pretty big move because, like I said, for pretty much my entire life, uh, and that's 23 years worth of living, uh, the only place you could get alcohol in Pennsylvania was a state store. And to my knowledge, no other state in the union allows uh, alcohol to be only sold in state stores. It was kind of a weird thing that Pennsylvania had. I personally don't know why it was only allowed to sell, be sold in state stores. Uh, my personal guess is that it has something to do with the blue laws, because I know Pennsylvania kind of has a few funky blue laws. Uh, one of the most prominent being the fact that you can't sell cars on Sundays. Well, not in dealerships anyway. The governor says that uh, his plan, in addition to shutting down all the state stores and opening twice as many private uh, businesses, also involves uh, basically doing like a sort of like a raffle deal. And over the next several years, it could generate a uh, billion dollars in business in Pennsylvania, or something like that. You may want to just like click the link in the story. Let me click the link to the story below for full information. But I'll be interested to see where this goes because uh, it is so firmly entrenched in Pennsylvania that, uh, like I said, to me, it's weird. And who knows, maybe like uh, with twice as many places selling beer, there will be twice as many people getting drunk. I don't know. Uh, but I'm not for or against this. I don't care. Just because, like I said, for me, way of life. But uh, we'll see where this goes. Uh let me know what you think if you live in Pennsylvania of this new thing going on. If you don't live in Pennsylvania, uh, go ahead. Make fun of how weird we are for doing what we do. Uh, that's all I got for today. I'll see you next time.